And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create a little planet. It's easy to do in GIMP, but the results they vary depending on the photo that you use. Let me just use such a cityscape. I copy it, rename it, then I go to filters map and little planet. Check the preview and GIMP does the rest for you. Let us check the tilt first. For this typical little planet effect you should keep it to 90 degrees. Right, you can even go in the negatives like this. Or once again, for this typical look, it's around 90. You can zoom in and out for some images that make sense. But if you zoom too far in, the effect is somewhat lost. You can spin it which is simply a rotation effect. And there's also a panning function right here. By default it's zero. Forget about the drop down, the resampling method doesn't have an impact here. We can just keep it. And you could technically also inverse it, but that doesn't create results that we need. I'll confirm and you can see the white sky doesn't create the best background for this effect. So the results they depend on the photo. Let me choose this one and it has a blue sky and even some ocean in the background. And I reapply the effect. On this time we've got a much better result. So what you get once again, highly depends on the photo that you use, so pick the right one. But afterwards, it's easy to do in GIMP. Just go to Filters, Map, and there it is. And this is how you can create this little planet effect in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.